so hey hey everyone today Arno is going to warn Mirabu Mirabu is the head of the Assassin's Council uh, he's going to say that Germain who was the silversmith we met earlier Germain has some another identity that we should warn him about Elise? let's see what happens Monsieur Mirabeau? Elise? Elise? What is this? I found him like this. I didn't. Of course not. But I have to report this to the Council immediately. They'll know what to do. No! They don't trust me as it is. I'll be the suspect, first and last. You're right. Of course, you're right. What are we going to do? We find out what happened. Okay, so Mirabu is dead and we need to investigate the scene. I think I should start with the body. What is that? It's the weapon that killed your father. That's a Templar badge of office. What's it doing here? Painting a picture. Poison. Let me see that. Aconite. Hard to detect unless you know what you're looking for. Popular with Templars, is it? With anyone who wants to get away with murder. But yes. Looks like he was expecting a visitor. Who? Master Kamar. Can I talk to her now? No, no, okay. So we need to visit Master Kamar now. I don't think I should waste my time chasing that thief now. It's down there. Ah, Monsieur Dorian. What can I do for you? Mirabeau is dead. Dead? Murdered. I knew this truce would come to a bad end. I'll have to summon the rest of the council to deal with this. Elise had nothing to do with it. I'll stake my life on that fact. Please, give me a little more time. I'll find the killer. Very well. You have until tomorrow morning. No later. Mirabeau was poisoned with aconite. Poison? 
Do I need to point out that that particular strain is a favorite of the Templars? You do not. Where might one acquire aconite in such strong concentrations? Any doctor could prescribe it in diluted form. I myself take a tincture of aconite from my heart. It's strictly regulated, of course. But I do know of an apothecary in Lamare who's willing to overlook such petty legal matters. Thank you. Who is making that sound? I need to find out. So we need to visit the app Cathy. Hey. Hello my friend. Not today my friend. I think I can handle it. Bonsoir. I wonder Shit. if you might end. Not again. Well played. Wait. Damn you, come back here. Yeah, Slow I need down. to chase this guy down now. So he can use smoke bombs. I just have a few questions. For you boys. Where's the jump spot? Stand back, you animal! Please! I've never told anyone! I did just as you said! What are you talking about? You, you're with the other one, aren't what? you? The hooded man. Tell me about this other one. Who is he? I don't know. I never saw his face. Ah! He threatened to kill me if I didn't give him the poison. I didn't ask questions. Ah! I keep only a small quantity in stock. He took that straight away, but he told me where to drop off the second dose. Second dose? Here. That's all I know. I swear it. Go on then. Think of this as a wonderful story to frighten your grandchildren with. 
Well? You were right. He gave our mysterious killer the poison. And he said the killer wore a hood like mine. Well, there are shades of grey in every good story. If we've been betrayed from within... That would explain why the killer tried to frame me. Here. This is where the apothecary delivered his wares. What are we waiting for? So the killer is someone from the inside, from the assassins. Okay, so that's the end of part one. Thank you. See you in the next episode.